Have you ever had someone who has promised you something and that promise never comes to pass? It seems as though you have waited for a long time for that person to fulfill his promise. But it seems that he never comes to fulfill his promise. You know, men are like that. Human beings are like that. We change. But we have a God that never changes. The scripture says that Jesus is the same yesterday, today, and forever. So the word that he spoke to you 10 years ago, three years ago, it will come to pass. Some of you have been promised by God that this thing will happen in your life. But wait for the promise. Because God is not a man that he should lie. He's not a man. The, the scripture says that he has exalted, he has magnified his word above his name. So his word is true. Heaven and earth will pass, but his word will remain. So God is a promise-keeping God. And it is evident in the scriptures of how he has been faithful. Right from Abraham, when Abraham, his name was Abraham, then it was changed to Abraham. He had promised, God had promised Abraham that he will give him a son. For those that have read the scripture, you know that Abraham later on had a son. Though it seemed as though it took so long, but God kept his promise. Remember, his timing is the right time. You may want something today, but when God has a better thing for you tomorrow, at the right time. So God is a promise-keeping God. Whatever he has promised you, hold on, it, hold on to it. Do not lose your faith in Jesus. You know, when Jesus was about to leave, he told his disciples to gather and wait in one accord. And he promised them the Holy Spirit, a helper. It was not so long as they were gathered. If you, when you read the book of Acts, that they received the Holy Spirit. They began to speak in different tongues. And those that were around them, those that had them were amazed. So God is a promise-keeping God. Your healing is right at your doorsteps. Your miracle is very near. Just hold on to your faith. Keep believing. Confess the word. Meditate upon his word day and night. Speak the promises. Speak blessings over your life, over your family, over your marriage. Some of you are going through difficult situations. And you're trying to put things together. You may be a single mother. But God is a promise-keeping God. It is not so long. Just hold on to God. Just keep believing. It does not matter what people are saying about you. Just remain focused. You will overcome. Be blessed.